You already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification gang, etc., etc. Got my dog with me. Showtime SP to nobody that knows bodies. Okay, so Calico and Geechee Gotti. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Calico, Geechee Gotti, respect to Calico, respect to Geechee Gotti and everything that they do. Um, Geechee Gotti, obviously one of the premier top tier MCs in a short time. Mm -hmm. Geechee Gotti did with Battle Rap what you're supposed to do. Facts. When you get that opportunity, you get put in front of those names, you cook shit. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? You, you, you show up, you bring three rounds, you don't recycle, you know what I'm saying? You mm -hmm. don't get into no BS drama off the court. You bring your A game, and that's why Geechee Gotti is where he's at. When it comes to everybody that's came into battle rap the last five years, Geechee Gotti is on top. There's yep. nobody above Geechee Gotti. I don't care who you name, what you say, he's above twerk, he's above all of them. Geechee Gotti is that guy, you know what I'm saying? He is the, the staple of how you create a new generation superstar, mm. you know what I'm saying? Like. Uh, I was at my aunt's house and her cat was watching one of the Geechee battles on TV and they went in the bathroom and came out as a fucking lion. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, That's what? what I mean. He, he, would, he would transform your life. You know what I'm saying? Okay. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Let the gauge off. What you know about sh getting shot and still going to work because you ain't got no days off. You know what I'm saying? Like he, he, he changed the way a lot of the battle rap goes, the trajectory of the sport, you know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? He brought in, like, I'm not, the gang culture was relevant, was relevant mm -hmm. in battle rap. It was a lot of gang culture. Yeah. But Geechee Gotti went from, like, large drink battle rap to super size yeah. gang rap, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, everybody's got a bandana now. Everybody's a gang member now, you know what I'm saying? They claim and I, they everybody claim it with no problem. heavy now, you know what I'm saying? But, uh, Calico, um, he has had some good battles. His last battle versus New Jersey Twerk on URL. Um, mm -hmm. no, 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 I'm on a nutty block. Like, where Geechee at? Recycle some shit that he spit like four times already. <laughs> Got booed in Philly. So, we're gonna get past that to give you a past that. Mm -hmm. But on the real smack, book this battle. Ain't nobody getting killed, smack. Geechee Gotti versus Calico is, I think it would be fire. Um, and I'm gonna give it to, I'm gonna pass it to you in a second, but I just wanna tell you what they said. Geechee Gotti. Said, me versus Calico is a battle the streets won. And then, um, you know, Geechee got it. I mean, Calico responded and said, my ideal battle is Geechee in L.A. And then, you know, Geechee responded and said, that's crazy because mine is you in Detroit. We need our battle in either one of those or it don't count. Hmm. Now, enough from me. He passed it to my partner, man. You know what I'm talking about? What you think, uh, I, I, I like the matchup. Okay. I, I Definitely agree with you 100%. Geechee Gotti is the epitome of the new age of battle rap. Like the new, he gives it a different turn. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Like, you know, at, after a while, we we didn't know who to leave it to. You know what I'm saying? Now I can, I can finally say it's safe to say we can leave it in Geechee's hands. We can leave mm -hmm. it in Twerk's hands. We can leave it in Rum's hands. We can leave it in um, um, uh, 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 Saga's hands. You know, Jerry West. These are people like we don't mind leaving it to. But in order to do that, you got to take out some goats. You know what I'm saying? You know, mm -hmm. Verb, Verb has done what he needed to do. But at the same time, Verb is about to get to that status too. Where somebody's going to have to take him out in order for him to pass that torch. Right. With all of that being said, you know what I'm saying? Calico, the whole, if it's real, he said, he said what do he say? If, if it's real, it don't got to run. Yeah. And Geechee is, if it's, if it's real, you can tell, you can see it in their eyes. You know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? It's already revamped. It's a difference between metaphors and real rap. Mm. Man, slide. You see what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, it, it's yeah, it's yeah. things like that. You know what I'm saying? You could pass that on. You believed Calico because you knew uh, he was part of the BMF. Like, you knew, like, it wasn't that many people that, you know what I'm saying, that didn't know who Calico was in the streets and in battle rap. Same thing goes for Geechee Gotti in the streets and in battle rap. Mm. It makes sense how this could be the, the mirror match with the passing of the torch. I clearly have Geechee Gotti winning this battle, though, because mm. I'm, I'm, at, I'm at on the nutty block. Where, like, where Geechee at? Because I heard that so many times already. If he starts the first round off with that, Geechee already won the battle. But let's be for real. Like, Calico was fire in his battle in the 2 on 2. Him and Murder Move. The 2 on 2 that ended early, they was cooking. When they got to a certain point where he said, when he said that, uh, he said, when Murder Mook was telling um, T Top, like, you know, uh, you, you sold crack to your mother, I would have killed the nigga that sold crack to his mother to get my mom back. They was cooking. And Calico was part of that cooking. 
and Calico was good versus Ill Will, and he was good versus Big K too. So let's not act like Calico don't still got it. And don't forget, he made, he made, he made the biggest smash battle rap song of 2019. 19. This is true. This is Am true. I wrong? If I beat a nigga ass, whoa, whoa, am I wrong? If I beat a nigga ass, these rap right niggas be talking so crazy, but I don't beat a nigga ass. Come on, man. <laughs> if I call Cookie G for wax blood, I wonder who Cookie G, did you ever call Cookie? Did you ever call Cookie? Calico. I don't, I don't, I don't want that. That's too much. That's that extra stuff. I don't anyway, that. that's a lot. Uh, yeah, I don't smoke. But uh, that's a lot. Salute to my man Calico. But uh, <laughs> <laughs> New Jersey. It's, it's one of them things. But uh, my thing is, if we, if you now, if this were to go down, we gonna hype it up. We gonna make it that's sound crazy. We gonna make it sound good. Mm -hmm. But I don't know about you, but I know. But you know, I can clearly. I'm gonna have. I'm gonna have DG clearly winning this. Clearly? Because clearly, because Calico talks a lot. Mm -hmm. The face off is gonna be crazy. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Face like Cal was about to make it look like it's gonna be a, a, a landslide. Mm -hmm. And I don't know. Now one thing I will say about Gigi Gotti is he's garnered a level of respect from his constituents in battle rap, his associates, people that are above him, people that are below him, that nobody's gonna bring their B game. You know right. what I'm saying? Like Absolutely. every single person that Gigi battles against normally brings there again. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like you it's better. Very, you it's better. very rare that you're gonna have somebody like, oh, it's just Geechee. Uh, you know what I'm saying? I'm gonna give him a Hansel and Gretel battle. I'm not gonna pack my lunch. No, because mm -hmm. you're not gonna beat him mm -hmm. like that. You're not you know gonna win. Saying? You're not gonna win. You're gonna clearly get demolished. Yep. So what I will say is for Calico, if he's if he's lobbying for this battle and this is a battle that he wants. True. And then he could cause he can get it. You know what I'm saying? Like he, he and then Calico said an, another another one you know what I'm saying? Another little another little tweet nugget, you know what I'm saying, that I had seen this morning is uh any league who picks up me and Geechee will not only make a ton of money, but will have a classic to start the year off. So he's not he's not playing with uh he's yeah. not playing with Geechee, you know what I'm saying? And and we all know yeah. that Geechee will bring his A game. Calico um, does a great campaign. He does great campaigning. But when he gets on stage, it's not as like I think him versus Ill Will. I I, I clearly had Ill Will though. Like it's just did you? I, I did it, it. I don't know. It's just I'm not hating on Calico. I'm not. But to me, I just haven't heard the essence of Calico in a while. Mm -hmm. That's just me. Like it, it, you heard the couple spurts mm -hmm. in um in him versus uh, Ill Will, but yeah, man. Like I haven't seen a crazy cow. A crazy, crazy cow. All right, well, you know, you gonna you gonna see, man. I don't like when 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 we get to this level of performance and the things that people do. Um, I I I I got a lot of respect for him, and I know that he he's still able to do this. You know what I'm saying? Because it's it's not easy to just be this this level of legendary. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah, like, there's like a I reason said, why Calico, you're here. Yeah, yeah, it's a reason why he's Absolutely. here. Absolutely. And I respect the way the calico rolls, like. Mm -hmm. I'll just give you a little story, right? Um, I remember when Calico uh, was battling against Briz Rothstein mm -hmm. on um, Some Madness 6, right? Um, he, I seen him, right? And this is around, you know, back when Tech 9 was still alive, right? Mm -hmm. And um, rest, rest in peace to rest him, respectfully, you know what I mean? Um, he, I saw him in, in, um, in, in Manhattan. He was with like... He always be deep. He always is deep. Um, and I seen him, and you know, well, I, I don't know what I said as far as him battling Briz. I probably said he was gonna lose, whatever the case may be. But he respectfully came to me, twenty five deep. You know what I mean? <laughs> but it's this battle rap, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So you know, I'm, I'm by myself. Or, you know, he comes and he's like, "Yo, I got something for you. Watch tomorrow." And he, he put it in the battle, like, yo, I tell you, Vada ain't fly. And he just started going through, like, his lines. Yeah. But he's respectful to the point, like, I, I respect the way he rolls. Yeah. I respect his people. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, they, yeah. like when that situation went down, listen, they, 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 they're all hands on deck. And they, they've, oh, this is not, like, nothing new. They've always been like this. Yeah. The people that just, unfortunately, was on the other end of that situation just had to see that. It's battle rap mm -hmm. and it's street niggas. Mm -hmm. Street niggas don't care nothing about battle rap. No. Battle rap niggas care about the streets. Yep. 
Them niggas, they don't, they don't care. They will lay it all on the line. Yep. And they have no repercussions or no fear about anything. Nope. And he rolls with a lot of real, genuine, authentic dudes, you know what I'm saying? And they they, they get a lot of respect in the streets, and we've seen how that goes. But him and Geechee, uh... I'm about to say, let's not talk about, I mean, let's not act like Geechee can't have a few people. Oh, no, we're not saying that either. I don't <laughs> think he'll go there. I don't think yeah. he'll go there, because, um... Calico wants to still show that he's able to do it at this level. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like Calico mm -hmm. wants to, he wants to show that that he could do it at this level. And a good battle for him to have and would be a good one to see is him versus Geechee. If yeah. he could be the Geechee guy. Not to mention, not to mention any vet that goes up against Geechee Gotti, they know not to play with him. Right. So it's 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 one of those things where you're gonna get one of the better. I could honestly say the vets versus Geechee. Like any of the higher tier, like Sue Surf, it was the best best Sue Surf that we saw in a while. Mm -hmm. Um, uh, 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 who else? Best Arsenal. Best Arsenal in a while. Oh wow! You know what I'm saying? Uh, you got and you got. Shine was good too. Come on! Yo, Geechee gonna run out of people to battle by the end of the game. He, he gonna run out of vets. He gonna he have to battle there. other people. Like and yeah. then it's gonna be like, well, you've been battling Don Marino and 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 and, and Sharon, so you they ain't got those people to battle. You know what though? Gigi Gotti has got to that good space. You know what that good space is? Let me tell you about that good space. The good space is, if he shows up, has a good battle, we don't care if he won or lost. Nope. Like, nobody's up there saying, well, he lost to this person, lost to that person. Well, what about this? Nobody cares. Nope. As long as he has a good battle, that's all we care about. It's like, if he loses and it has to be bad, the only one, the only battle we hang over Gigi's head is Hayward. Hayward. He shouldn't have took that one. So, I mean... But he's getting now. He's getting his. He's getting his run back Man. though in the two on two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if yeah, they yeah. win the two on two, then then there's another kinda, boy. Another, another like, boy. Another boy. Another boy. Another boy. Another <laughs> boy. But uh, you already know what it's doing. What it does, man. This is all speculation. You know Sounds good. Looks good. Sounds good. Uh -huh. I want to see it. Yeah. I'm holding the sig. Your dome will get split. Mm -hmm. I roll in the whip. Mm -hmm. Go home to your kids. <laughs>